In today's unboxing, we have not one, but two ETBs of Paradox Rift. I was kind of iffy on opening these up, but I really want to pull the Roaring Moon or the Iron Valiant. So let's see if we can make that happen in today's video. I'm also real curious if we can get a promo that isn't bent in half. Okay, let's start off with this puppy right here. The, you know what? No, we're not. No, we're not. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna start off with this one with the Iron Valiant. Beautiful box, kinda. Wasn't a huge, huge fan of these, these box, these, uh, the box art that they gave us. I don't know why I just lied to you guys. It was like, beautiful box. No, I don't like these at all. That's <laughs> I will not be collecting uh, a Paradox Rift. Uh, I won't be, I won't be saving these boxes. I'm actually gonna keep the booklets. I do like keeping all the booklets. I'm gonna have like a little collection of just, you know, all the ETB booklets. Much stuff in here that uh, Pokemon gives us that I know just, whoa, 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 whoa. That I know just goes straight to recyclables for a lot of us collectors. So it comes with a cool little sleeve, you know, all. I'm gonna actually, I actually keep these. Keep these and I store them away. We have a little, the little baby iron bundle. I love, these two promo cards. My opinion, best promo cards that we've ever gotten in the uh, Scarlet and Violet era. Charmander was super cute. Don't get me wrong, huge Charmander fan, but I personally am a huge fan of Iron Bundle because I love Delibird. Delibird is one of the best Pokemon ever created. He's just so sick. So to have a future version of him, cannot go wrong there. Was very happy to add this to my collection. Did you guys love uh, Iron Bundle? I would love to know in the comment section down below. Put me on. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We get nine packs now in Paradox Rift, which feels like a, feels kind of like a ripoff because I believe the ETBs used to come with 10 packs. So we lost a pack. And I've had pretty good luck. Uh, with with Paradox Rift, I'm not gonna lie, my first my first pull ever was actually the Parasol Lady out of a three pack blister, so that felt awesome. Stanny, Simipore, Larry, can, can we pull the Larry card today? That would be awesome. First pack Magic, Golespod, Golesopod. This card is you know there's always a card in every set that just haunts you because you just pull it so often. This is that card. I have about three of these and I also have it in Japanese. So that's awesome. You know, if you, if you need if you need that card to to finish your master sale, let your boy know. Send it out for, I'll send it out to you for, for the free. But this guy, Panpar, look at how happy he is. Hopefully I'm not happy by the end of this video. Cause this is my last chance. This is my last chance. Wow, look at this iron bundle card. That's gonna go in the common binder for me. Uh, Gliscor, Pokemon Future Energy, Dwebble, Dwebble, that was his name. I always forget this Pokemon that exists, Horsey. And we got this thing that I can't even, even pronounce. Yesterday I was watching this video, it was pretty cool. I was watching it with my girlfriend, it was um, all the Pokemon in, from like Gen, I think I had Gen one through five. It was like a 3D, like 3D uh, video where you can like walk around the stadium and then it shows you all these cool Pokemon. So you can like, I watched it on my iPad. So on the iPad, you could just turn the iPad and then you could see like, you know, all Gen 1 through 5 and it's kind of like you're on a ride. It was pretty sick. Hey Palm, whoa, beautiful Iron Moth card. I forgot, I always forget about that card. Do we have something here? We have our first uh, illustration rare. Uh, let's see. Let's see what we have. Oh, Wimpod. Okay. Not the best pool, but it's cool. It's like a like a like a, a treasure chest or a treasure chest, a treasure ship or a pirate ship. And then we got the Ting Lu right behind it that no one cares about. So let's take a look at this card. 
really, really beautiful Wimpod. Cool, cool, cool. Do I want to encounter this thing when, you know, in real life? No, absolutely not. Most Pokemon would be terrifying. Absolutely terrifying in real life. But uh, not mad at that. Not, but not mad at that pool whatsoever. So let's see. That's our first. That was our first pull. First pull. A palm. Absolutely goaded Pokemon. Garbantula. Mantike. I actually used a Gar Gargantua in my Pokemon White playthrough. Tenemouse. Nanseal and Glosspod. I actually like. <coughs> People really like this Pokemon, and I don't understand why. If you're a fan of that Pokemon, let me know in the comment section down below. If, like, I was on, I follow a lot of Pokemon fan accounts on Instagram, and some, there's like a whole, like, subreddit of just people saying that, like, oh, Pokemon peaked when uh, Glossopod is, uh, was, was created, and I'm like, dude, what? People actually like that thing? Tatsuguri, so cute, the best. Amigo, Tatsuguri Reverse Hollow, that's going into the Reverse Hollow pile. And then Malotic, non, non-special. That's what I like to call them. People, like, can you guys like keep up with all the, all the, all the rarities? I don't. Sometimes I'm like jealous when I watch like opening videos and people are just, they know every single thing about the set. Snow Runt, super sick card. Sorry if I'm not that guy for you guys. I'm just a normal dude. I play all the games. Uh, Volcanion. We got a Wimpod. I think we have something. What do we have? Let's let's go. For, let's go for two, two pits. Two, two. Oh my gosh! We don't have anything. Why did I get juked? That was horrible. I'm sorry for doing that to you guys. Uh, like hyped it up. Um, yeah, some people they know everything about the set in and out. Maybe I should just maybe I should do better. Let me know in the comment section down below if I should <laughs> if I'm not doing enough for you guys. Okay, Magby, Vanillaite. Vanillaite is awesome. Or Corio is cool. Medical energy. I'm right, bundles back. Can you just bring us some luck? Bound sweet. Or B2 and Zatu. I love Zatu. Zatu is such a cool Pokemon. I think I'm gonna put that in my in my binder. Do you guys keep a uh, common binder or a reverse hollow binder? I just started. I just ordered another one, another uh, binder from Amazon. So I'm very excited. I don't know. If, I don't, I'm gonna try to somehow make an interesting video of me showing you guys my reverse hollow binder. Give me go. If you guys haven't, definitely go watch uh, the new Pokemon series, Paldean Flutes. Okay, I think we have something though. We have Tapu Coco. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me that was my big hit in this set. Oh, Tapu Coco. Okay, cool Pokemon. Yes. Do I like it? The, the colors are awesome. Definitely. Going to sleeve this bad boy. Not a bad pull. I do like the colors. The colors are awesome. But uh, okay, let's see. Last pack magic. But yeah, in Paldean Fates or Paldean Wins, Gimme Ghoul Episode One is just running through uh, the school. I don't know if you guys played the game, but yeah, definitely go check it out. I just watched. I just uh, watched all. I think believe believe there's six episodes. Such such a good series done so well it's pretty different from what uh what i was used to so semi sage plusle reverse need that i also love shark Adet. and then we end it with uh nah. can the roaring moon bring us what we need the roaring moon can the roaring moon bring us the roaring moon the last time i opened paradox rift i did pull a roaring moon it wasn't the roaring moon but it was a roaring moon this 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 promo is top tier let me tell let me tell you guys why. This promo, just let's just let's just appreciate this thing. And thank God, thank God it's not destroyed. As I like almost destroyed the promo. All of my promos, my ETB promos, have just been nasty. 
Yeah, yeah, I loved the Snorlax from 151, but just look at this card. Can we just, absolutely insane. And the pictures, the, the screen, the, the, um, you know, when they screened it, when they showed it online, it just does not do this card justice. Absolutely sick. For one, I'm a giant Jigglypuff fan. And to get a, uh, you know, ancient Jigglypuff, fight me in the comment section down below, but Screamtail is better than, it's better than Jigglypuff. My girlfriend hates Screamtail. I think he's just so much better. He's got cool hair, he's got cool teeth. You know, just, just absolutely, absolutely top tier Pokemon. Me and my friend Eric, we're gonna be doing a uh, Pokemon top tier, top tier list uh, pretty soon, probably this week. I love uh, love seeing all of it. Galvantula. I always pronounce it so wrong. And Iron Moth. I always like seeing like multiple people's takes on what their favorite Pokemon are and were, and see like how there's just there's just so many Pokemon that. that like there's probably a, you know, a uh, Hypno a fan group, you know, that they, they just collect Hypno cards. And I think that's awesome. And, and or Main Shao, you know, they're just like, oh, I just love Main Shao cards. And I think he's like the best Pokemon of all time. Or Flamingo, even this is just, this is just a, Flami a, a Flamingo. Octillery is awesome as well. And we have a Wo Chan holographic card, 042. You know, I definitely think Joltik is one of those Pokemon that uh, a lot of people love. Not that he's not super crazy, but he does have a good fan base. Bullet Bug, Fuet Coco. Fuet Coco is my new favorite Pokemon. Just, just to update you guys, that guy is awesome. You, in in that Paldean wins anime he's he's the star pretty much oh what the heck speaking of joltik bam this is the card i wanted i've been dying to pull this card this was uh it's not an expensive card but this is one of the best cards ever joltik with uh with bolton or yamper sorry oh my gosh amazing so amazing wow just Funny that I just spoke that into existence. Of course, we're gonna sleeve this puppy up because I love Joltik. He's just he's the best. I don't know if that's accurate sizing because I think he's the smallest Pokemon um, ever. He's a little tick. He's a little tick. I don't know if he's like. Hopefully, he's not like sucking the Emperor's like blood. So ho hopefully, that's that's a that's a whole another con another conversation. Uh, Blitzel. Bound Sweet. Bound Sweet is one of those Pokemon that you just forget that exists. Tetsuguri, same thing. Dondozo. I always. Mela. I want the Mela card. Really bad. Okay, what do we have here? Okay, it's a. Once. Hydrachi. And a. Mousehold EX. Mousehold EX. Not a bad card. Not a bad. I do not have Mousehold in my collection, so. In my EX collection. I definitely have a lot of repeats <laughs> for Paradox Drift. I just I got a lot of EX cards. That's for darn sure. I don't know if you guys have seen what the prices are now for the set for the top cards, but right now after I was just making the the uh, thumbnail for this video, and that big Roaring Moon card that we're chasing right now. Uh, Steelix, but it's not Steelix we want. Um, yeah, so Roy Moon card that we're chasing right now is actually uh, $70. That thing is just dropping. It is dropping. After this, might be the time to uh, to call it quits. That's why, that's why I made this video. And uh, yeah, actually I do have some Trubbish. Trubbish, Trubbish, Trubbish. So awesome Trubbish. Is that a reverse hollow? Is this a reverse hollow card? Oh, it is a reverse hollow. Um, and we have a nothing, Chin Pao. Yeah, so I'm gonna make a, definitely a, a uh, update for this this Paradox Rift set. And I do have some Korean Paradox Rift or uh, Ancient Roar 
and future gosh darn it i forget what that I forget what the, the set is called but i do have some coming in korean one more time just one last time i just want to pull some of the illustration rares and uh sirs and all that all that good stuff maybe some trainers in korean because korean is just as beautiful as ink double <laughs> oh no double tapu coco oh no the funny thing is uh i don't know if you guys are subscribed to danny phantom if you're probably in this community you definitely are are um but Danny Phantom was saying that Tapu Coco, that exact card that we just pulled right now, is the most pulled card in Paradox Rift. And now I completely agree because that's what we got. We got we, we're uh, two for two, two for two with the Paradox Rift ETB opening. But for me, it's a dub because I just picked up this Garbodor card. That will be the card of the day today for today's video scream tail awesome little scream tail we got a earth vessel beautiful reverse hollow nanslil and a deoxys oh look at this deoxys card on this channel we appreciate all of the cards but this deoxys oh beautiful deoxys hollow could be worth something someday but to me that card is beautiful and it's going into my binder and we get something good. Just a little, just, just a little Paradox Rift action to start the week, baby. You just, sometimes you just gotta open up, open some packs, you know, just to get the week going, and just to just just to put some good positive energy. We got some good hits. We got um two Tapu Tapu Cocos. <laughs> we got uh, a Joltik, which I've been wanting to pull, so that's gonna be awesome. And I think that short's gonna do well because a lot of people love Joltik. A lot of Joltik fans out there. Tatsuguri just being super, super cool. Groudon, ooh, dope Groudon card. So we pulled some great cards and some doubles and some not so great cards. Thanks for checking this one out with me, guys. And if you like more videos like this, I'm gonna link some right about here. Until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.